Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. It's Unicorn for me. <laughs> oh my god, to sing again. We're here for Mother's Day's weekend. Mother's Day is we'll talk about it later. just having a good time today we can go eat yum 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 fries burgers and fries why are you still let me do my design okay <laughs> okay all right y'all so i haven't really said much but hey we got our nails done everybody show your nails you look so good thank you mom for treating us you're welcome <laughs> <laughs> for treating us now we're gonna go and get some food because we're hungry okay it is time to eat this is a beautiful day. It's so nice outside. So while we was in the nail salon, there was this ratchet lady that came in there and they had to kick her out. He said, like, get the F out. He was like, get the F out. And then she got up with her big old eyelashes and slapped down um, the nail polish that was on display. And then he was like, get out before I call the cops. And I, I don't know what happened. But the moment she walked in, I looked at my sister and I was like, she looked like trouble. And then all of a sudden she got kicked out like 10 minutes later. But I missed the whole everything until she hit the thing because I was getting talking to the lady, like having, you know, conversations. And um, yeah, she got kicked out and started flinging stuff. <laughs> and it looked like she was pregnant. Right? I'm like, you come in here for a service and then you're going to act like that? She didn't pay for nothing because she got did they do something for her? Oh. That's probably what she wanted. Yeah. Get a free whatever. Because she thinks she's entitled for a service for free. I think somebody's trying to come. We got to get out the way. Mm -hmm. But yeah, we finna go eat. And then after that, we're going to go see my nephew. He was born not too long ago. And then I'm going to go do some hair and then head home. So, catch y'all. Huh? Yeah. She says she need a hairstyle before her, her children talk about her. All right. I'm going to you guys on the We taking a picture. Oh. I mean, we can do a thumbnail and then we'll take a picture. Just come stand. Stand. And we can smile. Okay. So, as of lately, in all of my videos, I've been feeling like I have to, like, encourage people especially when i feel like i'm a little discouraged so i feel like me encouraging you helps me to be encouraged so i just want to say to anybody out there that feels like life is just doing whatever it wants to do just know that it is going to be all right like it is going to be okay things will get better you know this week has been a bad oh they almost got into an accident this week has been a very, very, very trying week as far as like just different things happening in my finances, different things happening at work and co-workers and just and in my household. Like it just seems like there's so much chaos. It just know that things have been happening and I feel so defeated. Like I feel so defeated. I feel like I just want to give up. But I know that in this process of feeling defeated and in this process of feeling like I'm going to have a breakdown, there is a breakthrough that's going to come from this. And I just want to encourage anybody else that feels defeated. Just know that God will never give us more than we can bear. And he puts us in situations so that we know where to turn to and who to trust and to put all of our faith in him, even when it feels impossible. Um, I'm getting emotional because I just I feel so defeated, but I know that something is going to work out. 
he always makes a way and you know after having yesterday when I felt like I just wanted to give up on everything I was reminded even in that moment to have peace because God just gives us grace he is a merciful father and you know although I feel like there's nowhere else to turn I still have something in me that wants to fight and you know I just I just want to want you guys to to be encouraged to to not give up even when it seems like it's the easiest thing to do keep fighting keep fighting for what you know God told you and God showed you because better days are coming in He's just testing us to see what we would do in this moment. Will we pray? Will we give will we give up? You know, will we turn to what's easy or will we fight because you know, at the end of the day, something something great has gotta come from all all of the tests and all of the trials because you know without a test you won't have a testimony and right now well for the past year almost two years I've been tested and it's been so hard it's been so hard but I feel like because I've been so faithful to to learn who God is and so faithful to put him first it's been easy too and you know I just feel like he just hit a wall every time you feel like you're one step closer you get pushed pushed even further back but continue to push forward continue to trust God continue to pray continue to fast and he will definitely make a way and things will work out the way it's supposed to not the way you think but the way God intends and everything will be all right and I'm just I'm I'm grateful for having that mindset and I'm grateful for being able to not talk myself off, off a ledge but being able to encourage myself along with encouraging you guys um, but we have made it to where we are going to eat and I will talk to you soon <laughs> get it, get it, get it. Mm. Ooh, I can't. <laughs> we made it inside. We're about to order our food and eat. <laughs> order our food and eat. <laughs> Some lunch. It's my first Mother's Day. <laughs> so, <laughs> anyway, <laughs> Either that or Strange. 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 Either Make you with your buddy. a daughter to be proud of. Have a beautiful Mother's Day you deserve. Oh, thank you, Mom. I love you too. Have a wonderful daughter on Mother's Day. Mother's Day. No, we need to call You're an amazing cat mom. <laughs> Your loving kindness <laughs> and caring nature make you a daughter to be proud of. Have the beautiful Mother's Day you deserve. Love. <laughs> Thanks, Mom. Thanks, so Mom, for my Mother in the Day gift card. Sweet. I wish Teeny could have came with us. Oh, good day. Oh, no.
It's falling. It's falling. It's falling. It's falling. Oh, see that the coat of my eye just sliding. Oh no. What a nice con. And my mom, she treat she treated us to get our nails done. So we got our nails done and our toes. And yeah, I'm gonna get something too, but I'm not gonna say what it is. So it's coming. Thank you. Oh, my gift? Yeah. Can you, put, can you put it on me? Can you put it on me? Hold on, I'm telling a secret. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Ready? Yes. Okay, so hopefully whoever got me again. It's a new car. <laughs> <laughs> new car? You want a new car? Wait, so you changed your mind. You want a new car? I don't know. <laughs> She's not sure, but she keeps on saying stuff. Why? You should get a new car. You should get a new car. She should. Because that car is like You deserve a new car. That and you car. had that car for years and years and years and years. I and years. did, I did. It's time to. I'm gonna get it fixed on the 22nd. So no. it'll be. Ba -ba -da -ba 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 so. Hopefully. Wouldn't it just it. be better to go find a new one? I'm new gonna one. look for a car. We are. We definitely are. Me and Dad, we're thinking about it. You should get like an SUV or something. Can y'all also think about looking for me one too? Yeah. 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 I think I need to get a new car too. <laughs> I'm so well, serious. this is a new car table. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so serious because like, Your car's acting I mean, I won't be on the road as much anymore mm -hmm. soon, but it's just, I told that car hurt highway yeah. driving. Yeah. yeah. It runs out of oil. It shouldn't be burning oil, but it burns oil. Before and I have, have to, and I have to put, huh? There's a little boy. Okay, y'all. So I'm back in the car, and the last clip, I was saying there's a little boy because my mom was saying that there was a little boy that peeked up over behind me, and so I got up and I said hi to him, and like in my heart, I felt like he was already five or like four or five. So I was talking to him, like something you might not know about me but i love children and i love babies especially but like little kids have my heart so i literally stood up went around the um the booth and i'm like hi how are you and so we started talking and i'm like you know you look like you're about four or five and he was like i'm five and i'm like nice i have a son who is going to be five in august and i just wanted to say hello and he's like hi and you know i thought it was the cutest thing and i even seen a baby I have like a clip of me talking to a baby in the nail salon. He was on his mom's chest, just relaxing. And the moment I started talking to him, he like started getting all happy and jumping up. Like, how you doing? <laughs> You're so cute. Me, if I see a child, I'm a talk. Like, I love babies, and it don't matter whose kid it is, I will talk to that baby and make sure that they feel seen and heard, even though they don't speak back. But you know, just to make them smile because I just love children. But that's what happened in that last clip. But I am on my way home right now. I didn't get to see my nephew today because his mom was doing a lot of running around. And I'm like, I don't want you to feel rushed because I want to see him. Like, you'll have to plan a time, um, you know, to come and hang out. But I did go and do my aunt's hair and I just left from there. So I'm gonna continue this vlog tomorrow, which is officially Mother's Day. And yeah, I'll see you then. Hey everyone, I wasn't able to finish the video like I said, so I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Turn on your post notifications for more videos that I post in the future. And I will definitely, definitely see you in my next one. Bye everyone. Bye.